everybody, I'm Ashley Skeva, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today I'm going to show you how to change your login options on your Mac. Now sometimes you want your computer to log you in automatically and not have to wait, but other times, maybe while you're out and about, you want to password protect your computer to make sure that it's secure. So let's change our login options. From your Mac's home screen, we want to go to the Apple in the upper left corner and click on System Preferences. Once System Preferences is open, we want to choose Users and Groups. After we get into Users and Groups, you will see a list of any users that are using your Mac. So if you have an account for your kids or your spouse or just yourself, you'll see those on the left-hand side here. If you want to change your login options, you want to unlock the lock in the bottom left corner. So we're gonna click on that and we're gonna type in our password. Now we can click on login options, which is underneath the list of users. Your first option is automatic login. Now automatic login is a choice that will enable your Mac to boot up and immediately send you to your account's desktop without putting in a password at a login screen. So you can choose which user can have automatic login individually, or you can shut it off, requiring everybody to put in their username and password when you turn on your Mac. So we're gonna shut ours off because we like to be a little more secure, and this is a laptop, which means it goes a lot of places, and I don't want anybody seeing any of my files. Now we can also display the login window as a list of users or just a name and password. A list of users is great if you are using a family computer, a name and password is great if it's just you using your computer and you wanna make sure that you're always booting up to the same login information. You also have options like show sleep, restart, and shut down buttons at your login window. Um, you can show password hints, but you can also shut that off. So if you don't want anybody to guess what your password is based on the hint, you can turn that off. We can do voiceover in the login window and we can show fast user switching uh, as full names or first names. And from there, once you've chosen the options that you want for your custom login screen, you want to click the lock in the bottom left corner to make those changes, and you'll see everything is grayed out, meaning you can't make changes anymore without putting in an administrator username and password. So once we log out, you'll be taken to your login screen. You'll be able to see all of your options displayed, so you'll see our shutdown, restart, and login buttons there at the bottom. So whether you decided to shut off automatic login and use passwords every time or turn on automatic login if you're the only user on a computer, you're all set on changing your login options for your Mac. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.